Welcome to this Cold and Dark Start tutorial for the LVFR A320 family covering the A318, 19, 20 and 21. We're using the A321 for this demo so let's jump inside and begin. So first of all head up to the overhead panel, switch the batteries on and the fuel pumps. Activate the external power, switch on the APU master and start the APU. Once the APU light shows as available, switch on the APU bleed. We can now switch off the external power. Before we move down to the pedestal, we're going to set the ADIRS to nav mode. Now on the pedestal, let's set the engine mode to ignition and flick on the engine to master switch. A good start on engine number 2 is signified by an M1 of around 19. We can now switch on the engine 1 master switch and wait for a good start on engine number 1. With both engines started, return to the pedestal, set the engine ignition mode to normal. Now switch off the APU and the APU bleed. To make it easier for you to follow my full flight tutorial after this, I'm going to work through the pre-takeoff checklist displayed on the ECAM at this point. So we've done the auto brake the signs, I'm going to arm the speed brakes and finally we're going to set the flaps. If you've planned a flight in the world map just pop down to the FMC here and verify that your flight plan, the initialize page and the perf page has all fed through properly and is pre-populated for you. Give the ideas a minute or two to align and make sure the PFD and ND look normal before pushing back and taxiing out. And that's it, you can now push back, taxi out to the runway, and follow my full flight tutorial. I hope you found this useful, if you did, please drop a like, feel free to subscribe for regular sim content. Take care, and I'll see you next time.